Friday night with us. Uh, it's been a pleasure to hear from you all. You know, when my husband Steve and I moved to the county, we did so with intentionality. We wanted to live somewhere that matched our values, that would do things like invest our tax dollars, not just in laying more pavement, but in investing in the kind of options in pursuit of that elusive goal of livability. And so the question at hand is now, how do we protect those values that attracted so many of us to the county at a time when, frankly, big spending projects have raised a lot of concerns among citizens, when instability in our commercial sector is, is threatening uh, our tax base, and when our growing population is posing new demands. Um, I believe that, that the answer does rely in, in responsibility, but also in taking the long view. I believe and I know that we can be budget conscious in the pursuit of progressive values. As a policy advisor working in resource-constrained communities, I have learned to ask tough questions about efficiency, and I think that you'll see that in the solutions that I've elevated throughout the campaign. For example, when we talk about housing affordability, looking at zoning, and related ideas, uh, like parking minimums and the burden that they can pose uh, in, our, in our metro corridors to affordability. And I also think that responsibility has to be more than just being efficient with a dollar. It's about being responsible for the good of the whole and taking the long view. You know, as a commissioner in our processes here in Arlington, as a volunteer in our schools and appointee, as somebody who plans to be in Arlington for the very long haul, I believe I am positioned to take that long view. I'm glad to have the support of so many Arlingtonians, including 20 of our elected officials, most notably every member of our school board and all of our Richmond delegation. Um, I'm proud to have the support of the firefighters and teachers that serve Arlington's family. And I would be honored to earn your support. Thank you for the consideration you've shown us tonight. Uh, I hope you'll extend it uh, to consider and, and consider supporting me with one of your two votes on November 3rd. Thank you.